Thanks for joining us. Let's talk about the conditions there. What's the latest? Oh, well, I'm standing on Highway 13. This is one of the busiest highways in the city. And because of the record-setting snowfall that we had here yesterday and overnight, dozens of vehicles were stuck on this highway for most of the night. People trapped in their vehicles. And they're still doing clearing operations here as we speak, uh, trying to get some of these vehicles free. It was mostly transport trucks that got stuck at first, and then it followed with other cars. And so people spent their night, spent the night in their cars, eventually the city brought in buses and uh, got some people onto the buses to help them warm up a little bit. But this is a real problem. They're still digging out these cars here. The highway is closed. And that's because we had a record setting snowfall just under 32 centimeters yesterday. The old record was just around 12 centimeters back in 1958. A little snowplow doing some uh, clearing there behind you, Steve. But how long do you think before things can get and some semblance of activity back on the roads. There goes a snowmobile right by you. Yes, sorry, I just, the snowmobile's coming by here. I haven't seen that in a while on the highways here. Yeah, so uh, the mayor has tweeted today basically asking people to just stay home because even in town when we were driving out here, dozens of buses, city buses, have been stuck on the roads as well. Uh, overnight just because of the slipperiness and the snow accumulation. Uh, all the schools in Montreal are closed. We've just heard Concordia, McGill, all the universities are closed as well. The airport, which isn't far from here, dozens of flights delayed or canceled this morning. So it, basically, the mayor is asking people, take the day, stay off the roads, and let us start to clean up uh, from this mess. Steve, thanks so much for being there, and thanks for bringing us the latest. It's CBC's Steve Rukavina on Highway 13 thanks, in Montreal.